first for Essex County. A woman is charged with vehicular homicide after authorities say she caused a deadly accident by a simple distraction. Eyewitnesses reporter Anthony Johnson is live now in Newark with details for us. Anthony? Well, Lori, as you know, and as Heather talks about all the time, driving on the roadways out here in New Jersey, anywhere in our region, tough enough as it is, but it can really be tougher when you add in the distraction. One of these devices in your hand can be reckless behavior and it could lead to a whole lot of danger. And that's exactly what happened out here on these roadways. Rahway, New Jersey resident, 35-year-old Jennifer Sehoye could end up spending 10 years behind bars if found guilty of vehicular homicide or rather manslaughter. Authorities say they have proof that she was texting while driving. She was involved in a fatal crash back on October 10th while driving southbound in the express lanes of Route 1 and 9 near Interstate 78. Prosecutors say her vehicle crossed over into the local southbound lanes and hit the vehicle driven by 58-year-old Carlos Cavallo of Elizabeth. The impact was so powerful, his truck overturned. Now, Cavallo was ejected from the truck. He was pronounced dead out here at the scene. His family telling our Jim Dolan last night he was a father of three, worked as a welder, and would have done anything for his family. Cops say Sehoye was also driving with a suspended license. Authorities also told our Jim Dolan last night that they have ways to detect whether or not a person is texting while driving when they're involved in an accident. That is the latest live from Newark, New Jersey. Anthony Johnson, Channel 7 Eyewitness News.